good morning everyone welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here please watch my other videos subscribe to this channel um i'm shooting my very first vlog <laughs> Woo, let's see how this goes <laughs> um yeah it is thursday today it's the 18th of august um yeah you're gonna spend a couple of days with me um today over the weekend um and on monday um yeah just a, a couple of things i mean today um i just have a busy day in the afternoon with meetings but um i'm actually gonna leave now to go to my therapy session and then when i come back um i'll have a couple of meetings um but tonight um i'm actually attending an event with my friend um at invest tech so we'll just yeah shoot a little bit of that <laughs> I'll, I'll vlog that a little bit and then this weekend I have a kitty's birthday party to go to with my nephew um and then monday is a very special day um i'm gonna be fetching my new car so yeah spend a couple of days with me let's hang out a little bit this is not a normal day in the life of Lulika. it really isn't uh, yeah i will most likely do a vlog where i do normal things but it just happens to be a week where there's just some activity happening in my life um so yeah i'm gonna go take a shower get ready for the day and yeah i hope you enjoy sit in my office for a couple of hours <laughs> um because i have now meetings literally from about like 12 right up until like the evening um and then i'll be getting ready um and getting dressed to get to the investigate event later <laughs>
like you're in my ooh. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> So much we fun. had so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey guys, so I want to just chat quickly about last night's event because it was really, really great. Um, it was Kirsten Leo speaking about a whole bunch of futuristic things and things that are currently happening in our generation. You know, the Great Resignation, Ikigai, a lot of like mental health stuff and. What people are currently doing in the workplaces starting businesses retiring from working into entrepreneurship retiring from entrepreneurship into working people starting businesses the different types of just cool things that happened during covid that was so much fun but it was also a really oh, such a cute thing to see so many black young people who have shmoney <laughs> in one room and just yeah just enjoying that um that vibe they had great food that drinks it was so cool i went with my knee my friend mini and it was just yeah i love conversations like that and i want to have like more and more conversations um like that with other people but also just like attending events like that for me just really helps in understanding the world apart from what you like read on twitter what you see on Instagram or whatever the case may be. So I love attending talks like that and events like that. And I really want to do like more and more and more of it. So yeah, um, I'm about to head out to the shops um, to make some bad decisions. <laughs> I'm literally like trying to b lose weight. I'm going to do juicing at some point um, because yeah. And the thing is with my body is that it takes a while when I start like, you know, cutting things out of my diet. I cut out the carbs. I'm currently meat free. I only eat fish um, and vegetarian. And I'm already like lactose intolerant, so I don't have dairy. So when I cut those things out, it's a very slow process to me losing weight. But then once I lose weight, it goes like this. <laughs> it's literally like five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like I lose, lose like the kilograms just keep going down so i can't wait to get to that point i actually do think there's two things i just need to do i need to run a little bit more outside um apart from working like with my personal trainer and then i also definitely need to drink more water like water helps because the only way you lose weight is through urine and sweat so it's either you're working hard out at the gym or you're eating well obviously but like you're drinking water and you're draining out all of these toxins that really just helps with like the weight loss and water is something I'm not great at at the moment so I really want to fix that I just came back from making bad decisions I went to go get a waffle for my commas and some snacks because I want to watch a movie so this is gonna be me I don't even know if I'll have supper who knows but yeah just gonna chill morning morning hi guys it is saturday um it's the 20th of august yes um i'm so excited about today it's my friend's little girlie's birthday and my nephew is coming um so i'm taking him to the party meanwhile i'm taking myself to the party anyway <laughs> so zizi is coming i'm excited we're gonna have fun we're gonna have face painting i just yo i'm so excited because in my first video in my kitchen we tag i said children make me happy so i'm so excited to be just around children today so yeah so you'll spend the day with me as he arrives as we go together Yo, I hope I can be able to vlog this in the car because Zizi tends to be very fussy in the car. But we'll see how he is today with me. I don't know whether he's fussy just with his parents or with my mom. But he's going to be great because every time he comes to see me, he just loves me. <laughs> so I'm excited. All right, let's go.
Oh, yes, my darling. We just came back from the party. I am so exhausted. Yo, 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 yo. I'm exhausted. I just got changed. I didn't even bath. And I really, really, really want to bath. Um, I'm whispering because he's sleeping right now. Um, I'm just watching some content on YouTube and just chilling in front of the gas heater with a glass of red wine. Just, yeah, while he sleeps. It's only six and he's sleeping i actually feel like waking him up because i don't know if he'll sleep later on at night and i'm like awake now but like by nine <laughs> it's gonna be game over for me <laughs> so i hope that he is gonna want to sleep at some point oh god y'all yeah, guys i'm getting practice hey like having a child is not easy it's not easy but it was so much fun today. It was so much fun. Oh, it was just fun. It was just fun. I mean, I don't know how parents do it weekend in, weekend out. But I had an amazing, amazing time with him. He had a little bit of cries over there. He was falling. He was like, you know, he didn't like hurt himself, hurt himself. But he was doing like little boy things. So, yeah, he fell over a couple of times and cried a couple of times. But it was great. I had an amazing, amazing time with him. So um, now we're just winding down. I'm going to wait for him to wake up. I am actually going to feed him. I'm going to have bath time with him. I'm going to put him to bed. And hopefully he'll sleep. Hopefully. If not, he'll just need to watch a couple of cartoons or whatever um, on Netflix. And I'm hoping that that will just pop him right back out. <laughs> so tomorrow I'm hoping that we're going to go to church. I'm like literally hoping we can go to church if not it's not gonna happen and i'm gonna go to church at the six o'clock service in the evening when i come back from like dropping him off back at home because yeah you know new week is starting work is starting and i also need to read a couple of things and reply to a couple of emails um tomorrow once i've dropped him off but i've had an amazing time hey guys so i test drove like a couple of cars um, last week I didn't like film any of it um, so I went to go view like a Range Rover Evoque um, and a Jaguar E-Pace and a BMW um, X2 and today I was at Mercedes-Benz and um, what I was saying is that it is such a hectic decision yo this thing like like you <laughs> and and the thing is I love my car so much I've had my car for eight years it's paid off it's in great condition. It has really never, ever, ever given me problems, ever. Like, never. Like, it's never given me an issue. And it's because when I buy a car, I usually buy it, like, brand new. And has a maintenance plan. And I take it for services. And whatever is broken, I fix. And all of that stuff out of the maintenance plan. So, all of that stuff for me is, like, so important. Um, yeah, so I'm really trying to make the best decision. I am stuck between two cars. I'm stuck stuck between two cars and it's very clear which one is a front runner but at the same time i'm just like mm, but the other one is so cute you know and i went to go see the second option after i went to mercedes-benz i went to go see the second option again because i was like i need to make the right call here because i am going to stay with this car for years so hmm yeah guys stay tuned <laughs> Stay tuned. Hey guys. Um, 
Woo. What is the day? It's Monday today. It's the 22nd of August. I am at my friend's work. I'm fetching her. Um, we are going to fetch my new car. I am excited. <laughs> I am so excited. So yeah, we're about to drive there now. Um, yeah, like this is going to be such a short little snippet of this vlog because yeah, it's just, it's one of those things where it's so overwhelmingly beautiful that it's just something that I'm just like, it doesn't need like a whole video on its own. Um, but I'm, I'm very excited. Alrighty. Are you going to be doing this? Yes. No. All day long. Hi guys, welcome to Lilaka's YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I am with her on this last drive. <laughs> with my second baby. With her second baby. We are yes. off to fetch our third baby. Amen. Um, who's going to bring forth our other baby. Oh, I cannot wait for that. But that's a story for another day. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> so this is our last drive. Oh man, too excited. I need you to put some background music that shows victory, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Lord, we thank you for this car. We thank you for the blessing. We thank you for your presence and your spirit. I'm excited now that I'm actually in the dealership. I'm just excited. <laughs> oh, hi, how are you? Good thanks. I spoke to Floyd, she said I must have a seat here. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you're waiting for him? Yeah, I'm waiting for Sunday night. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can you order something to drink so long? Oh, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. Thank you. Thanks so much. Bad camera person, I just want to scream. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay, like, not simple, but it's 
komplett blöd ist, wenn ich zu picken ab und ich bin zu picken ab und ich bin zu picken ab. Oh my god oh this is so amazing all right so i need to go pick up my baby mr zoo i am so excited my third child i've just been picking up like mobile automobile babies <laughs> that's it but yeah i just want i'm so excited i'm so happy i'm so happy that she's here it's just such a nice thing to have god is just so cute man oh man Mm, the way God loves me is just really, really amazing. Yeah, here's to many more happy, safe journeys in my third baby, Miss Sizzle. 